hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how i went from this very dark brown almost black color to this very light ashy tone kind of color uh, this was very cheap it was made at home by myself so if you want to know how i did it then please stay tuned before starting the video i just want to put a disclaimer out there if your hair is naturally dark brown black color this tutorial will not work for you guys because you will have to go uh, with a bleaching process first if this is your first time dyeing your hair to go lighter uh, there is no way that you can go lighter in my opinion without a bleaching process if your hair is naturally dark brown black and if you want to go lighter i also suggest that you consult a professional uh, just to make sure that no damage is caused to your hair and again this tutorial will not work for you if you have natural dark uh, black hair all right guys uh, so if you are interested with the rest of the video then please stay tuned Alright, so step number one, I'm going to go ahead and remove this unwanted permanent hair color that I currently have on using this color fix hair remover I got from the Sally Beauty Store. To start off, I'm going to be mixing the container number one and number two together. Make sure you're using a plastic bowl and a plastic brush in order to mix together and apply onto your hair. Just like I show you here. Here I'm just brushing my hair and then I divide my hair into section. Kudos to my Santa shirt. And here I'm just applying the mixture number one, number two together that I just mixed. I am making sure that I am applying that all over my hair so there is no like black spot left here and there. And this is pretty much what I'm going to be doing. It took me like maybe 20 minutes to apply this all over my hair. Make sure you go in the back, you flip your hair back, you go underneath, just like I'm doing right here, especially like all the way to the end. So once you're done, uh, you're going to go ahead and put a plastic bag on, leave that product, you know, do his thing for like 20 minutes before you go ahead and rinse it out. I went ahead and used this coconut co-wash to wash my hair. Once I was done, I towel dry my hair. I also used my hair dryer just because I was in a rush to apply the new color onto it. Okay guys, finally time to apply the new color. I am using this from L'Oreal Paris. The shade is B61 Cool Brown and it lifts up the color up to three levels and it's anti brass that's why i picked this one it's also not too blonde uh, but it gives like a nice dark uh, blonde ash brown tone i'm going ahead here and mixing number one number two i am combing my hair as always brush or comb your hair first divided by two and i'm starting to apply the product starting from my length all the way up make sure you don't touch your roots too much because it's going to be lighter compared to the other part of your hair uh, so make sure you insist more on the length of your hair instead yeah i like to flip my hair and then just make sure that it's everywhere so I don't miss any spots. Once I was done, I went ahead and used the co-wash again to rinse my hair. And this is the final result, you guys. I was really happy with how it turned out because it was really the color I was looking for for my hair. Uh, it's not too blonde, it's not too brown, it's really like in the middle and exactly what I was looking for. I got a toner from Sally Beauty Store. I'm still going to go ahead and tone my hair but that's going to be in a next video. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that one. And yeah, if you have any question about this whole process, please make sure that you comment down below. You can also DM me in my Instagram. And if you enjoy this kind of content, then I will be more than happy if you subscribe to my YouTube channel. And until the next video, I will see you all in my next one. And take care of you guys. Bye.